Hey guys, how you doing? My name is TJ and in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to optimize the SEO of your website in Wix and also show you how to integrate digital marketing as well. Now, SEO is how people find you on Google and digital marketing is how you market your product and services so you can generate new leads that hopefully convert into paying customers. Now, this video is sponsored by Wix, so make sure you click the link below to follow along and optimize the SEO of your Wix website as well. But first, make sure you like this video and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and feel free to comment below any questions that you might have as I'm going along. All right, guys. So the first thing that you do is to log into your Wix account. When you now get, make sure that you select your website. And now come here to the menu bar on the left and click on the marketing and SEO. And that will now take you to this page where you see on our marketing homepage that the most essential thing for us to do is to get found on Google by boosting our site's SEO. So if we click start now, that will now walk us through step by step, adding all of the information that we need to boost our SEO on Google. So right now I'm just going to create a business name or site name. TJ's face max store next. Nope. This is an online business only. So now, how would you describe your business? So this is where we can actually add a few keyword phrases that accurately describe our business so that people can kind of match to our business based on those keywords anytime that they are searching. So we are an online face mask store face protection. So those are not going to be some of my SEO keywords. And now I'm going to create the SEO plan. And now these are all of the different steps that we can take to boost our site's SEO on Google. The first thing that we should do is to set the home pages title for search results. So all of these steps just walks us through each and everything that needs to be done to get our main task of being found on Google done. OK, so if we click the first one. So right now, our first task is to set the home pages title for search results. And here it actually recommends titles for us based on the different keywords that we previously entered. So right now is online face mask store. If I click to the right, I'm going to actually like this a lot better. And it's now providing me steps as to where to go to actually update this information. So if I click go to editor, this will now take me to exactly where I need to be to input the information that needs to be updated. All right. So now that we are here, this is where you want to update that information, where it's asking you what the page's title on search results and browser tab should be. So if we click into here and we paste what we copied before. This is now a preview of how search results will now show up anytime that people are searching based on our keywords and they find us. All right. Once you now finish this part, just come up here and click save. And click done for now. And let's go back to our dashboard here. So now that we updated our home pages title, let's just come back here and refresh. That now shows that this task is done. And this is essentially what you have to do for each and every one of these at these tasks is to go in, click into it and actually do what is recommended for you to do. Save those changes and update them. And all of that will be updated in Google by Wix for you. So I'm going to click on the next one to add the home pages description for search results as well. And this is actually going to recommend to us what we need to do, which is to include at least one of our keywords, include our business or site name and keep it between 50 to 300 characters. So if we go to our editor. So now that we are here, this is what we need to update, right? What is our page about? We need to actually add a brief description that describes our business and the content of the web page so that Google can help people to find our business. All right. So now that I am done with that description, I'm just going to click save. 
and that has now been updated click done and now I am going to go back to our dashboard and do the same thing by clicking refresh so now next steps is to actually connect our to a domain so that people can just search for our business by our domain name instead of just searching keywords for us so if we click go for it that did now take us to a page where we can connect our domain to our Wix website. Click go to domains. So once you now get here, you have two options. And the first option is to buy a new domain name using Wix. And the second option is to connect a domain that you already own. So if you don't own a domain and you have to buy a new domain, this is something that you can do inside of Wix by just clicking here and you'll see that Wix also offers you the first year for free and all you do is just type your potential domain names for your website here so I am not going to be purchasing a domain name for this tutorial I'm just showing you how to actually do it here so now going back to domains uh, make sure that you connect your domain name to your site because that'll now make it a lot easier for people to find you using your domain name than the custom domain that Wix created for us. So now back to our dashboard. So when you now update your domain, just come back in here and click refresh. And the next thing is to now connect to the Google Search Console. And if you just hover over this eye, this will actually give you information of why you need to connect your site to Google. And the main reason is so that you can track your SEO insights to verify your site using the Google Search Console and to also get instantly listed in Google search results. So that's why it is very important that you connect your website to Google. So if you don't have a Gmail account or a Google account, make sure that you definitely create one for your business so that you can easily be found on Google. Okay. In okay, case so now this is the last step on the SEO checklist and you will not be able to connect your site to Google until you finish each and every single one of these steps. OK, so once you now finish that, everything will be automatically implemented for you by Wix setting up your SEO integration with Google search results. Now, once you do that, step two is to now start to optimize all of the different site pages on your website to be better optimized to be found by the Google search engines. So if you click on step two, you'll see that we have a checklist of different parts of our page that we actually need to go into and to update the information to improve our SEO results. So for example, the first step is telling us to, up to update the contact details on our homepage and the next step is now telling us to connect social networks to our homepage like Facebook, Instagram, etc. And you know, these are all of the different aspects of our web page that we need to update that'll help to improve our SEO rankings when it comes to showing up on search results. So definitely make sure that you go through each and every single one of these pages as best as you can and just add all of the recommended changes and text and information that Wix is asking you to add because all of those things will help to improve your SEO search ranking. All right, once you now finish that, you can still continue to build on your SEO progress. So if you click on step three, you see that you have two options. The first option is to take a look at the SEO guide to just see further tips that you can use to improve your SEO. And the second option is to just hire a Wix SEO partner that will really help you to implement all of these changes. Now, once you now finish this part, another very important part of SEO and just digital marketing in general is setting up email marketing because this is how you are now able to just generate more leads and to just try to improve your sales pipeline to try to convert leads into paying customers. And Wix has all of that built in and already integrated into the Wix platform. So this is a one stop shop for you to set up all of your email marketing as well. And you can find that in our menu on the left. So over here, if you just click email marketing, 
This will now take you to a page where you have a bunch of different email templates to choose from that you can use to now set up your email marketing. These are a bunch of the different template options that you have here. This is the recent one that I was working on. And these are just tips to actually help you to get started setting up email marketing for your business, right? A tip here is to just learn how to build your mailing list. Another one is, is, is to start importing a mailing list if you already have one. And the main one here is to get started with email marketing in just a few steps, right? So if I click read more, let's see how Wix helps us with that. Now, when it comes to setting up email marketing, there are just a few quick steps that you should take. And the first one is to create an email campaign followed by actually managing your mailing list, followed by sending and sharing that email campaign to the people on your list, and then using your dashboard to actually analyze how your email campaign is doing. And after that, you know, updating your email marketing plan to increase your quota, connecting your domain, and to also just remove ads from your marketing emails. So those are just the five steps that we can take in Wix to get started with email marketing. So definitely make sure that you come here and click on a template. So let's say that I clicked on this monthly newsletter one, I would just click the use template. And this is now where we can actually come and edit this template. So if I come up here, I can now change it to TJ's face mask store monthly newsletter and just update this template with all of the information that I want. And then after that, click next. And this is where I can actually add the recipient of this email newsletter that I just now created. So these are just examples on our site right now. But once you actually add those people, you just click next. When you click next and Wix now gives you the option to either send now or to actually schedule this email campaign to send later on. So those are the two options that you have. And you also have an option to actually send a test email so that you can see how this will look whenever it actually goes out to the people on your mailing list. So now back to our dashboard. Now, another thing that is very important for improving your SEO and just helping out with digital marketing is doing Facebook and Instagram ads. Now, this is very crucial when it comes to having a marketing plan and just having a, a fully scaled out SEO plan in general like Facebook and Instagram ads are very crucial because there are billions of users on Facebook. So this is a great platform to do ads in to be able to target different demographics that your products and your services might appeal to. And again, all of that is fully integrated into Wix so that you can create Facebook ads right from the Wix platform for your website. So that is just here on the left menu. So if you click Facebook and Instagram ads, let's just take a quick look around to see the integration that Wix has. So here in Wix, Wix's AI will actually take care of helping you set up those Facebook and Instagram ads. So don't be scared if you don't have any type of knowledge about, you know, how to do ads at all, because the Wix's AI tool will actually take care of that for you. And you can click this to just watch a quick video on how that tool works, or you can click start now to actually start to work on setting up your Facebook and Instagram ads. And the first step is to make sure that you connect to Facebook. So if you do not have a Facebook, it is very important that you create one, especially for your business, uh, so that you can now run Facebook ads for that business. So again, it is very important that you create a Facebook account if you want to run Facebook ads for your online business. All right now, so those are just a few tools that Wix provides for you to help you with your SEO and digital marketing. And the first one is to first help you to get found on Google by optimizing your website to be found on Google search results and to just rank higher when it comes to Google searches. And the second step is to now set up email marketing because email marketing is very important 
to your digital marketing plan when it comes to generating new leads and also converting warm leads into potentially paying customers. And the third step is setting up Facebook and Instagram ads. But Wix also has a few more tools that you can use to just better optimize and to just, you know, better create content that will help you to convert customers. So if you just come back up here and go to the marketing home. So once we're here, you can see that you can now track your Facebook ads in Wix, track your email marketing campaigns in Wix to see you know how many emails were sent out, how many were opened and clicked, and how many actually resulted in orders, and which emails are driving the most revenue. And again, these are a bunch of different email templates that Wix provides for you. And also down here, we see that Wix actually makes it easy for you to create uh, videos as well and to also create content for social media platforms and if you come all the way to the bottom these are all of the different marketing tools that Wix provides to just help you to create better content to help generate more leads and to drive more sales so that's it if you need to set up SEO for your website and also integrate email marketing and just digital marketing in general, Wix is a one-stop shop that has all of that built in so that you can actually come in here, create your online business, optimize it to be found on Google and to, and to rank higher in Google search results, set up your email marketing, and also set up Facebook and Instagram ads as well amongst a whole host of other tools that Wix provides for you. So make sure that you use the link below to create your website on Wix and to also set up your SEO and digital marketing as well. Comment below if you have any questions and also just let me know about your experience using Wix to set up SEO for your website.